Sand through the hourglass, so go the days of our lives. So prophetic. It's from some soap opera. Oh, days of our lives. Yeah, that makes total sense. Hello. Good morning. March 24th. I mentioned on last week's vlog that this week's was going to be very special. Uh, I didn't tell you why it was going to be so special. So let me share that with you now. It's my birthday. It's my birthday. How sad is that? Yep, March 24th, 1968 was the year that I popped out. And uh, still here. So Linda and I have some plans for later in the day. It's gonna be a kind of a weird day because tomorrow morning I have to get up extremely early. There is a flight to Toronto and then a flight off to um, San Diego. Work related, not fun related. Should be a good trip. I'm going down to San Diego for a convention. It is called the Optical Fiber Conference. Um, so if you have any questions about fiber optics, I'm your guy. Down there for a few days, uh, come back on Thursday. Friday is Good Friday. Uh, and then we move into Easter weekend. So yeah, birthday. And what did the birthday boy get? You may or may not know, watching through various videos that I've done over the, uh, the years, I'm a bit of a music guy. I enjoy music a lot. Um, I have a lot of CDs, which I don't buy that much of anymore, but I certainly have a lot of records, which I still buy. And uh, like most of you probably, I stream a lot of music as well. I'm a big fan of um, The Velvet Underground. I have this record, The Velvet Underground and Nico. Everyone knows this one. I have uh, White Light, White Heat. Very famous record, some say their best. Not my favorite, but uh, great record certainly set the groundwork for a lot of seminal punk bands. I like this one a lot, The Velvet Underground. I think at this point, John Cale had left the band. Uh, and that brings me to a very special birthday gift I got from Linda, and um, it is this bad boy. I didn't have this on vinyl previously, I did have it on CD. It is a pink and white splatter, record store day only version, limited to 3,000 copies. Velvet Underground and Loaded. I love this record. I know this one probably wasn't very cheap. This was released in 2014 as a limited edition and uh, it is sealed, unplayed. So um, yeah, can't wait to listen to this a little bit later on in the day. Awesome birthday gift, awesome birthday so far. We're gonna head out, let's go have a beer. That's a wrap. Beer, check. Greasy breakfast, check. Awesome Velvet Underground record, limited to 3,000 copies, check. Yeah, pretty awesome birthday all around. Things to do now, I have to go pack a bag. Uh, yeah, 3 a.m. alarm set for tomorrow morning. Oh, give me strength but it'll all be worth it once I get to San Diego. Um, I apologize for the lack of cycling content this week. I have been riding outside. I didn't ride outside this week um, because winter returned and it has been bitterly cold here in Ottawa. It snowed a little bit. It didn't stick around, thankfully, but um, 
winter, even though we've moved into spring, winter is not done yet, apparently. But uh, next week looks better when I get back. So uh, more cycling content for you next week. And maybe a little bit more music content for you as well. We'll see. All of that to say, please have a great week. We will regroup next week. Take care.